Christmas buds. It's Kathy with Kathy's Garden and I am so happy that you joined me today. Today we're going to make specimen cards for our junk journals. But first a shout out to Nancy, Jane, Joyce, Hildegard and Cecilia. I appreciate each and every one of you. All right you guys so what I've gotten is a book page and I have mount, mounted it on some cream colored cardstock. Then I have a little piece of vellum and I have a little piece of coffee dyed paper. So what I'm going to do first is I am going to take my stamp, which is my postcard stamp, and I'm going to ink it all up. And I am going to stamp this book page just like that. Give it just a moment to soak in. There we go. Now, what I'd like to do is I'd like to bring in my punches. So I have an oval, I have a square, and I have a circle. So I'm going to actually choose the oval right now. And I'm going to open it up, and I'm going to get this positioned on here. See if I can get it as straight as I can. And then I'm going to put the top on it. I'm going to push it down, cut it out, open it back up. So I've got my piece and I've got my two pieces. Just like this. Now I'm going to ink around the edge. I hope everyone's doing well. And I invite you all to subscribe to my channel. It really will help me grow, and I would truly appreciate it. And I have a big giveaway going on, getting ready to go on. And so you need to be a subscriber to be able to participate. So I don't want you to be left out. All right, so we have a piece of vellum. So what I'd like to do now is Glue, put some glue on the back of my mounted book page and set it right onto my vellum just like that. Uh oh, I've got some, got something on my vellum. Okay, came right off. All right, good. Now I am going to get my book page and I'm going to select a butterfly. Now you can do a butterfly or you could do um, some botanical flowers, you could do a number, you can do some greenery, you can choose whatever you want to highlight in your circle. It doesn't matter what it is, whatever it is that you would like. So I'm going to go ahead and lightly ink on here and then I'll be ready and I'm going to put it fairly in the middle so I can position it. So I'm just going to stick it right here. Stick that down. Now I'm going to take, actually I'm going to trim this. It'll just make it easier for me. Okay, so now I'm going to position this where I want it. Okay, about like that get an idea. Now I'm going to put a little bit more glue and this time it's going to go on the vellum right where the book page is and I am going to once again look to see where this is. I'm going to eyeball it about right there and now I'm going to give it a trim And you can leave it just like this if you want, or you can sew around the edge like I made a few other ones that I sewed around the edge like this. And I like it sewn. I think it's really pretty. Now you have this leftover hole or piece that made a hole. But, and what we can do with this is you can get whatever like you can make a matching if you want so let's just do that so you're going to get yourself 
something similar that you used with your specimen card. And I'm going to grab myself a couple of small labels. Whoops. That one jumped out on the floor. I'll pick it up later. Okay. So, and then we've got a specimen card. I've already inked up around the cutout. Now I'm going to ink this up real very quickly. And I'll go ahead and ink this butterfly a little bit. It's mainly its antennas that need to be inked. All right, now I'm going to just apply a little bit of glue onto this label right here. I think I'd like it to be about like that. And I'm thinking I would like this to be, actually that's a little crooked, isn't it? That's better. Let's put that there. I think I better have the antennas down on it because otherwise I'm afraid the antennas will get pulled off. Now let's add a little bit of lace. Let's see. We'll put the lace on the bottom if we want. Let's see here. And we better get our fabric tack. Mm -hmm. Things are flying. A little bit of fabric tack down. Lay our lace down here like this. And I think I'd like to get a little bit of bling on there as well. Alrighty, I have some bling here and I think actually I'd like to put it right here maybe just one or two going right here See if I can get this to come down I just had it now why is it acting up I don't know okay that's enough I do believe I'll get my pen and we will get this on here Maybe. Oh my goodness, isn't that cute? So now you have a cluster and you have a specimen card. And you could just do all kinds of different things with this. I have quite a few that I've made. You guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And I'd love to see you in my next video. I'll see you there, guys. Bye now.